There's a condition you've already alluded to today that I am sure everyone has heard of, and yet if you asked most people to define it, they wouldn't be able to define it. I'm talking about none other than fibromyalgia. Fibromyalgia is um, a condition of widespread bodily pain that it impacts people above and below the waist, the diaphragm. Well, first of all, it's fibromyalgia syndrome. And whenever the audience hears syndrome, what they should translate that to, the definition of a syndrome, is a constellation of signs and symptoms that define a disease, but we don't understand the mechanism. What's the prevalence according to the current definition? What I, I can tell you just to give a frame of reference, um, chronic pain, we think there's 50 to 100 million Americans with chronic pain. That's a huge range and it depends on the way you ask the question. Of that 50 to 100 million, the most common chronic pain is low back pain at about 28%, neck pain 16%, headaches around 16%. Societal burden of chronic pain is terrifying, it's astounding. But when you put it all together, you're dealing with a half a trillion dollars. It's more than diabetes, heart disease, and cancer combined. And so what is the management for these patients? Is this a curable syndrome 